Solving for a variable inside parentheses in terms of other variables. In your Alex Pie, mouse over the light green slice, linear equations and inequalities to reveal the drop down list of topics you need to cover. Click on solving for a variable inside parentheses in terms of other variables. Here's an example problem. Solve for x, parentheses, 6 plus x, end parentheses, times k equals z. Let's click explain. To solve for x, we first divide both sides of the equation by k and simplify. Because with these in parentheses together, it's easier to get rid of this k first. So divide both sides by k, gets rid of it on the left, and then we have just z divided by k. And then we can drop the parentheses now that there's not anything left to multiply by. So then we just have 6 plus x equals z over k. Then we can subtract 6 from both sides and simplify, which gets rid of the 6 over here, moves it over here, and then we just have x equals z divided by k minus 6, which solves our equation for x. Let's try another one. Solve for y, parentheses y plus k, end parentheses, times h equals c. Here are my notes. Solve for y, parentheses y plus k, end parentheses, times h equals c. So the first thing I need to do to try to get y by itself is divide both sides by h. And so dividing this side by h gets rid of the h, and then it just comes over here. And so instead of just c by itself, it becomes c divided by h, or c over h. And now that this set of parentheses is by itself, and there's nothing left um, trying to multiply with it, I can just drop the parentheses because now it's just a regular addition, y plus k. And in trying to get y by itself, I can subtract k from both sides, which gets rid of k over here and just makes this the fraction of c over h minus k. And then I've solved for y. y equals c divided by h minus k. In my Alex screen, type in the answer that I got in my notes, c over h minus k, and click next, and it says that I got the correct answer. Thanks for watching.